Hello again everyone. In this video tutorial we are going to solve this given exponential equation. Before we solve this thing we want to simplify this equation a little bit. Look at these bases. These are fractions 3 over 4 and 5 7 over 5, isn't it? I want you to convert these ones into decimals. So in this step, we have converted this fraction into the decimal. So 3 over 4 turns out to be a 0 0.75. On the other side, 7 over 5 turns out to be equal to 1.4. And now we have to um, make a couple of observations. Since there is no possibility of getting a common base, on both sides as the left hand side base is 0 0.75 whereas the right hand side base is 1.4. So therefore we have no choice but to use the logarithm to solve this problem. So let's go ahead and take a log on both sides. Put down LOG on the left hand side and put down LOG on the other side as well. So next we will be using this fact. So whenever you have a log of, log of x and you have an exponent m, then you can bring this exponent up to the front. Okay, that's what I will be using the same fact over here. On the left hand side, our exponent is 7x minus one, I'm gonna move it to the front. Likewise, the exponent 2x plus 5, I'm gonna move it to the front. So we're gonna get then what? 7x minus 1 times log of 0 0.75 equals to 2x plus 5 times log of 1.4. Now we need to figure out the value of log of 0 0.75 and log of 1.4. And here are the values I have put down by using the calculator. Log of 0 0.75 is approximately equal to negative 0 0.125 and log of 1.4 is approximately equal to 0 0.146. Let's go ahead and plug it in. So log of 0 0.75 is negative 0 0.125. And on this side, log of 1.4 is approximately equal to 0. 146. Let's fill in the blanks. Rest I'm going to put down 7x minus 1 equals to 2x plus 5. Now we're going to go ahead and distribute. We're going to multiply over here. So that's what I'm going to do. So let's be careful with this thing. When you multiply 7x times this number, that's going to give you negative 0 0.875x. Negative and negative become positive 0 0.125. And on the right hand side is going to be simply 0 0.292x plus 0 0.73 so far so good now we're gonna the next thing what we're gonna do is we wanna move x's on one side and the constants on the other side to solve x for x so i'm gonna add 0 0.875 x on this side and we're gonna add 0.875x on this side as well. So this thing is gone. On the left hand side we ended up with 125 decimal 125 
equals to I want you to add this thing up this turns out to be a 1.167 1 x plus 0 0.73 now I want you to subtract 0 0.73 from both sides so this thing is gone on the right hand side we still have 1.167x equal to once you subtract this thing that's going to give you negative 0 0.605 so far so good 605 and now I want you to divide both sides by 1.167 to isolate x. And I want to do the same thing, 1.167. So pretty much this is gone. So we ended up x is approximately equal to when you divide these one, it's going to give you negative 0 0.52 and that is our solution thanks for watching and please subscribe to my channel for more exciting videos